an NBC 26 exclusive report. It's been one month since a mother of three was killed in a crash in Brown County. Now, weeks later, the family is still trying to cope with the loss of their loved one taken far too soon. Through all the pain, a shining light has helped three young boys and a mourning husband to continue on. NBC 26's Brooke Haves introduces us to that teenage girl. On April 6th, three boys ages six and under survived a crash with a dump truck in the town of Holland. Tragically, their mother died at the scene. Now their cousin Kendra Mraz has stepped up to help as these children struggle to live life without that one person they thought would always be there. Kendra Mraz is 16 years old. Her three little cousins are her favorite people in the world. They've always had a special place in my heart. Six-year-old Wyatt, four-year-old Wesley, and one-year-old Wiley have suffered an incredible loss. On April 6th, a crash took the life of their mother, 31-year-old Kara Clem. The investigation showed Kara had failed to stop at a stop sign. The front of the car was hit by a fully loaded dump truck. Kendra says it's a miracle the boys survived the crash with only a few bumps and scrapes. One human buckled me and a girl buckled Wiley and we went to the hospital. Gave them a huge hug when I saw them. You know, they're all battered and bruised, but you know, still, you know, still breathing. A tragic situation three young children can't even begin to understand. It's just I love my mom. You share your life together, you think you're going to grow old together and watch your kids be good, wholesome adults someday by all your labors and something like this happens and it just throws it all upside down. Kara's husband, Teddy Clem, says through all the tears and heartache, Kendra has been their rock, bringing some normalcy to impossible circumstances. One of the, the first things that I asked her um, after this happened was when she was coming over was, you know, Kara always said she felt like she was your second mom, and now that she's gone, I want you to be my kid's second mom. Kendra's unwavering devotion to family has helped them overcome some of their darkest days. Have you seen Kendra helping your dad lately? Yes! Family is everything is a message plastered on Kendra's Facebook and Instagram pages. It means the world to me that they have placed me on, you know, such a high pedestal almost. You know, they just, they look up to me and I just I really don't want to let them down. I think that there's a, definitely a, an underlying level of trust there that the kids have and a connection. It has become Kendra's main priority. Cooking meals, reading bedtime stories, and bringing laughter back into their home. I love hearing them laugh. I love seeing their smiles. <laughs> it's something their father never thought he would see again. They've sprung back so quickly. I'm very glad that they're filled with joy, and I'm sure that that will help me in the future. Um, but I'm so jealous of them. I wish I could just move on so quickly. You know, I, I just, it's hard. And although the family says they know their lives will never be the same, they're starting to realize life can go on. Where do you think she is? Mm -hmm. Having her here um, has been, it's helped me find at least some peace with everything. Wild man! And the healing process can begin. They're a part of her and she took care of me and now it's my turn to take care of them. Kendra and her mother are in the process of moving to Brilliant to be closer to her Uncle Teddy and the boys. Kendra says she will be at their house most days to watch them while their dad is at work. Together with journalist Emily Beyer, I'm Brooke Hafes with NBC26. What an amazing young woman. Well, Kendra has set up a GoFundMe page to help support the Clem family with any financial burdens they might be encountering. We have a link to that page on our website.